Hi everyone, I'm Tony. This is Tapatia, 32 foot sailboat that we're in the process of building, videoing and, and recording the build. Um, should be a 32 foot, as I say, junk rigged sailboat. Um, and perhaps something I haven't said before is, is what's, what's the purpose of this boat? Why am I doing it? And, and the answer to that one is that I, I intend to live aboard this boat and uh, cruise, sailor, travel around a bit um, and see how we get on with her really. And, and so at the moment we're recording the build. When she's in the water, we shall show you how she gets on in the water, record some of that and, and show you how she performs, how the various materials we've used perform and, and also of course where we get to, what we get up to, that sort of thing. But at the moment we're, we're recording the build. Um, trying to build her on, on a limited budget, shall we say. Um, as yet, I haven't really spoken about that budget and I've, a couple of, couple of you good people have asked me what, what sort of budget we're looking at. Um, probably coming up in a video soon. I'm, I'm certainly running through my head, preparing mentally to do a video on, on the budget for the build, what it's all cost to get this far. Um, so that's, that's coming in the near future. We'll get there. But what's happened this week is the question, isn't it? This week, uh, it's been and what's coming up in this video in fact. First thing we did this week was, was the port side deck box which also incorporates the the day tank the diesel day tank for the stove so quite a bit of work on that area and then moved up into this main hatch which, which you can possibly see wide open up the top deck area so I fitted that hatch and the third well Something else I did, which I haven't filmed, is I did quite a bit of sanding inside. This is a dusty, horrible job preparing the wood in there for, for the varnish. Um, didn't film it, but I did do a fair bit of sanding. But the other thing that we did this week that's rather exciting, I thought was, I told you a few weeks ago that I bought some pieces of um, black locust wood, which would be the outside trim on the boat. And uh, it came time that we had to attempt to mill it with my very cheap table saw and see how it would go cutting those those five centimeter thick, two inch thick pieces of black locust, big chunks of black locust. And we ran that through the saw and uh, indeed succeeded in cutting it. So that's all coming up. But before we get to that, um, I'd just like to say a big thank you to uh, new subscribers who came along this week, quite a, quite a few new subscribers this week. So it's very, very nice. So big thanks to all of you who are new here. And uh, let's not forget the people who aren't new here. Big thank you to all of you subscribers who've stuck with me, who've followed this far along. Very nice. Um, and if you haven't subscribed, please do so. Alrighty, let's get on. Well, I've got these three slabs of black locust, Rabinia, and uh, just rough sawn planks out of a trunk. And today I'm going to take the small one of the three, that's this one here, and uh, try and run it through the table saw. See how it goes. Table saw, as you may well remember, is a particularly cheap model. <laughs> so uh, we'll see if it's up to cutting this. Nice long length of black locust. I'm going to get a couple of pieces out of that one for the... Uh, sort of tow rail parts, I should be very happy. There they are. We'll see what it goes like. I bought this ripping blade. Which I'm going to fit on the saw. Brand new and hopefully the trusty old saw with that blade on is going to cut that black locust. I will find out soon. You will find out soon.
but it all went very well. Um, got a bit of a curve that way, which hopefully we'll be able to pull out, straighten out, but have a look at that grain. Come get in close on that. That is so like a teak grain. So teak-like. Varnished out, I can see that being glorious. And it's cut, cut very easily. I don't know if it's the quality of the blade or, or what, but it was just cut, ripped black locust on a very cheap table saw. That is the result.
Well, that's it for this week. Um, give us a thumbs up. Leave a comment. I'm happy to get your comments. I always try to answer. I, I try to answer them all. It's possible I miss one or two, but uh, I hope not. I try to answer all the comments I get. Um, yes, thumbs up, subscribe, or uh, think about supporting us in one of the various ways you can. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye. <laughs>